What's good, y'all? Your boy Amen's back with some new heat for y'all today. I've been fiending to watch some more Game of Thrones, man. I'm really enjoying the show. Definitely a lot going on, man. I can't wait to see like what else they got in store for us. Um, so I know I'm probably gonna have to start making these reactions um timed. So y'all have to pull up the video on y'all side, and then I'm gonna just say ready, set, go, start. We start at the same time just to avoid future copyright issues. I think I'm gonna finish season one like the same way I've been doing it. And then after that, we're probably going to switch to time. But I'll keep y'all updated on that. But we are on episode four. Um, I'm going to just watch the preview. And then we're going to watch the intro, man. A lot of y'all were saying, don't skip the intro. Um, but it's long as freak, bro. It's long as freak. Like, we're going to watch it this time. But all right, let's get into it. The Khaleesi. The Khaleesi have baby inside her. The Khaleesi had baby inside her. Burn them all. I'm leaving this morning. My job is out there. What's a lot of different stories going on, man? It feels like One Piece anime. When he earns it. What's like so much going on? We got Khaleesi, Cal. We got the Nice Watch. We got King's Landing. We got Winterfell stuff. Tyrion Lannister, the Imp. We gonna let the end the uh, opening rock this time, y'all. Mm -mm -mm. This do got a nice ring to it. This intro long as freak. It feels epic though, like when it starts and when it ends, it feels like getting into some shit, isn't it? But it is long as heck. I wonder if he's gonna get his memories back. The bird got three eyes. Oh no. <laughs> Wolf still be playing, bro. We have visitors. Don't want to see them now. If I was cooped up all day with no one but this old bat for company, I'd go mad. That's shape. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Help Bran down the hall. Why he walk in there like that? You like to ride, Bran? Yes. With the right horse and saddle, even a cripple can ride. I'm not a cripple. Mm. Then I'm not a dwarf. Give that to your saddler. He'll provide the rest. You must shape the horse to the rider. Start with a yearling and teach it to respond to the reins and to the boy's voice. Oh, it's a little me mechanical little thing. Why do you want to help him? I have a tender spot in my heart for cripples, bastards, and broken things. <laughs> Couldn't resist some northern ass. If you like redheads, ask for Rod. Come to see me. Dang! Kind of you. I still remember seeing my father's fleet burn in Lannisport. I believe your uncles were responsible. It must have been a pretty sight. Shape. Watching sailors burn alive. I suppose your father realized that when your brothers died in battle. Now here you hey, are. who was this dude's father? Your enemy squire. Careful, Imp. I've offended you. Forgive me. He got a slick mouth, bro. He know how to, like, get under people's skin. Your next tumble with Rawls is on me. I'll try not to wear her out. Dang! <laughs> he about to mop her. <laughs> are we back at the Night's Watch? Now pivot as you deliver the stroke. Put all your weight behind it. That man look trash, bro. He brought the bop him. Please, no more. On your feet. Pick up your sword. Hit him. <laughs> he said, uh, uh. <laughs> He said, uh. Seems they've run short of fortress and thieves down south. Well, that's funny, bro. <laughs> he yielded. All right, then, Lord Snow. You wish to defend your lady love. All you gotta do is get past the bastard. <laughs> you gotta mop all three of them. To do this. No. Deal, deal, deal. 
<laughs> I, I, I quit, I quit, I quit. Stop playing, stop playing. Stop playing, man. We're done for today. Go clean the armory. That's all you're good for. Why don't you fight him? You're gonna have to defend yourself. Why didn't you get up and fight? Damn, bro. <laughs> Spitting out on him. Why not? I'm a coward. The world's no place for cowards. Well, you're right. I'm sorry. I just wanted to thank you. What's he doing here, bro? He seems like a good dude, though. Yeah, people like him, man, I be feeling sorry for. They be getting, like, bullied in high school. So I always try to, like, be friends with, you know, people like him and just, like, defend them. Because I hate, I hate when that happens. Where Khaleesi at, man? Let's go. The city of the Horse Lords. Pile of mud. Mud and shit and twigs. This brother dude still alive? Call them what I like because they're my people. This is my army. Cal Drogo's marching the wrong way. Who does he think he is? You sold slaves. Aye. Why? I had no money and an expensive wife. And where is she now? In another place with another man. You did all of that and she was somebody else? Oh, this is a tutor. The brave men didn't kill dragons. Rode them from Valyria to build the greatest civilization this world has ever seen. <laughs> Good eyes. I have always wanted to see a dragon. There's nothing in the world that I would rather see. Really? Why dragons? They can fly. Birds can fly. And they can kill. Mm -hmm. Hey man, hold on, that's hot wax. It burned away. Hey, 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 hey. Well, after 15 years in a pleasure house, I imagine just seeing the sky makes you happy. <laughs> that's that, that shade. Seen what have you seen? I've seen, I've seen a man who could change his face the way that other men change their clothes. She trying to see a devil dragon, you know what I'm saying? What's up? So be it. She grabbing that thing. Dang. The seven kingdoms into one. Freak. All you gotta do is talk about dragons around her and she going crazy. What did I buy you for? To make you sad. <laughs> he bad. Your grace. Well, go on then, get on with it. Dang, it's about to get on with it. Someday, your husband will sit there. Her brother get on my nerves, bruh. I can't wait till he get mopped, bruh. He gotta get mopped. Jane Paul's mother had five children, all of them girls. Yes, but it's highly unlikely. But what if... I don't like the sister, man. Arya's my favorite character so far, y'all. You will find it in your heart to forgive your father. No, I won't. It's the Hands Tournament that's causing all this trouble, my lord. The King's Tournament. She's a headache, bruh. There's nothing else, my lords. This man about to die at any moment, bro. Till tomorrow, my lord. I've been hoping to talk to you about John Allen. His sickness struck him very hard and very fast. This is the previous um right hand of the king. Lord John often came to me for counsel. Why? Kings and hands have come to me for advice since. What did John want? The night before he died. Right, don't avoid the question. I came inquiring after a book. A book? I fear it would be of little interest to you, my lord. Um, Tell me the motherfucking book name! No, I'd like to read it. With descriptions of many high lords. And. The walking is gonna kill this man when one of these episodes. Just walking. And you're quite certain he died of a natural illness. Well, what else could it be? Poison. A disturbing thought. No, no, no. I, I don't think it's likely. I don't know if I trust him. I'll find my own way out. I don't know about this dude. I don't trust him. This this grandmaster dude or whatever. That Arya? That's my daughter. It's a hard fall down these steps. Sirio says every hurt is a lesson. 
and every lesson makes you better. <laughs> See what you're saying. She says every swordsman should study cats. They're as quiet as shadows and as light as feathers. You have to be quick to catch them. He's right about that. That's true. I ain't y'all ever caught a cat. You will marry a high lord and rule this castle. Mm. Your sons shall be knights and princes and lords. No, that's not me. Mm. She said, I don't want that. Should I push that king's way of living on the hearse? She said, nah. Hello. So Alistair said I'm to be your new watch partner. <laughs> it's been snow. <laughs> it's been snow like, oh my God. You can't see. Come stand by the fire. You just can't see, you can't fight. No, that's all right, I'm fine. You're not. You're freezing. Is he gonna have some type of a uh, training arc? What are you doing here, Sam? On the morning of my 18th name day, my father came to me. You're almost a man now, he said. But you're not worthy of my land and title. Hmm. He got disowned. Then we'll have a hunt. And somewhere in these woods, your horse will stumble. And you'll be thrown from your saddle to die. Also, I'll tell your mother. Nothing would please me more. Dang. So Alice is going to make me fight again tomorrow, isn't he? Yes, he is. Mm. Say, so, oh. Um, better, you know. It can't get any worse. That's shape. <laughs> <laughs> I like him. He just need more confidence. I feel like he's going to have a growth, like a growth spurt. Do you know Sir Hugh of the Vale? Not surprised. Is this what the Grandmaster dude was talking about? He was worried about him being on the council. He was knighted almost immediately after his master's untimely death. Knighted for what? This is crazy. He's walking and talking. I think he loves Ned's wife, bro. Now look, there. That one belongs to the Queen. Pretending to read her book. Larissa the Queen. She's one of mine. Hmm. Is there someone in your service whom you trust completely? Mmm. Gotta have eyes everywhere. After that, you might want him to visit a certain armorer in the city. And it's possible that they saw Lord Aaron visit this armorer several times in the weeks before his death. Mmm. Perhaps I was wrong to distrust you. Distrusting me was the wisest thing you've done since you climbed off your horse. Dang, he ain't giving no type of... Do I trust you or not, motherfucker? This is fine work. It's not for sale. Mm. Sorry, this is the king's hand. If his lordship wants the helmet, I made it for me. When Lord Aaron came to visit you, what would you talk about? Mm. Just ask me questions, is all, my lord. What kind of questions? Then he started asking me about my mother. Your mother? She died when I was little. She had yellow hair. She'd sing to me sometimes. Look at me. It's the queen. Is that is the queen his um mom? Get back to her, lad. You say yellow hair. Find anything? King Robert's bastard son. Hmm. Oh, so that's the king son. Did I leave it with? Listen. Do you hear that? Don't leave nothing with him. He likes to do this when I'm on duty. He makes me listen as he insults my sister. We've met before, you know. Have we? <laughs> Strange, I've forgotten. Oh my gosh. We fought side by side one afternoon. Dang. You're gonna go crazy. Come here. <laughs> he said, let me smell it. The message from Lord Stark. I don't serve Lord Stark. <sighs> He don't like Lord Stark, huh? Got angry. He mad his sister and they're getting mopped by the king too. You shouldn't be trying to mop your sister. Nasty. There's no place for him in the world, so he's come here. We're not gonna hurt him in the training yard anymore. His name is Sam. No matter what Thorn says, he's our brother now and we're going to protect him. But if Thorn puts me up against Lady Piggy, I'm gonna slice me off the side of bacon. <laughs> Snow about to kill this man. <laughs> you see his face? 
Uh oh. Dang, he got his wolf with him. Oh, I'll be scared as freak. What are you waiting for? <laughs> you get in there. Well, ain't nobody gonna do nothing. Go on, hit me. <laughs> He's saying yield, yield. They been flopping like they do on the basketball court. Oh, I'm so tired of this dude, bro. You send this call to give me commands. I, I just wanted to invite you to supper. What is? It's a gift. I had it made for you. Dropped back in rags. Are you going to dress me now? Please. Oh my gosh. Yo, she better calm down for calcium. Turn me into one of them, wouldn't you? Next, I want to braid my hair. You've no right to a braid. You've won no victories yet. Ooh. You do not talk back to me. <laughs> You are and now you've woken the dragon. Ooh. This man said, oh. I'm a Khaleesi of the Dothraki. I am the wife of the great Carl, and I carry his son inside me. Mm. Next time you raise a hand to me will be the last time you have hands. Khaleesi! Talk to this nigga! That's my girl. That's my girl. Why not? Because I'm fat. No, but I like girls just as much as you do. <laughs> Tell them, Sam. They might not like me as much. Damn. I've never been with one. You probably had hundreds. <laughs> as a matter of fact, I'm the same as you. You a virgin too? He said, ah, ah, you lying ain't this motherfucker. There's a lonely room with a naked girl. Didn't know where to put it. Where <laughs> to put it. <laughs> Cat. A whore named Roz. What color hair? Red. That's the same, uh, ah, oh, that's the girl, that's the girl. And her, um... <laughs> <laughs> he said, uh, uh. <laughs> That's the girl that the dwarf was saying uh, he was gonna mop. And why is my surname Snow? Because you're a bastard from the north. He was confident my in that. My father wouldn't even tell me her name. Mm. Cause all I could think was, what if I got her pregnant? If she had a child. Mm. Another bastard named Snow. It's not a good life for a child. Dang, noble. I rock. I like Snow. So, that would have went crazy, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Enjoying yourselves. You don't know Cole. Mm. Neither of you do. The horses died first. Didn't have enough to feed them to keep them warm. <laughs> Sam. <laughs> Even the horses were easy. But later when we started. That wasn't easy. But who asked this man for his life story? Soft, fat boys like you. Could have lasted a fortnight on you and still had bones left over for soup. Damn. Had to eat, motherfuckers. I hit him. I hit the dragon. You did good. was the last dragon. My brother will never take back the Seven Kingdoms. He couldn't lead an army even if my husband gave him one. Mm, she said my husband. She's getting more confident and more confident. <laughs> Snicker, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm sorry, do I? Sansa, dear, this is Lord Baelish. He's known... An old friend of the family. I've known your mother a long, long time. Why do they call you Littlefinger? Arya, <laughs> don't be... <laughs> Arya. <laughs> I was very small, and I come from a little spit of land called the Fingers, so you see, <laughs> it's an exceedingly clever nickname. Start the damn joust before I piss myself. 
The hound's older brother. And his opponent. His older brother. Yes, yes, enough of the bloody pomp. How about him? Yeah, this this king dude, man, starting to annoy me. Dang. Golly. I thought he was gonna have more of the story. The way he was out there training and measuring steps. I thought he was uh was that was that the same person? God dang. Not what you were expecting. Has anyone ever told you the story of the mountain and the hound? Gregor never said a word. He just grabbed his brother by the scruff of his neck and shoved his face into the burning coals. Held him there while the boy screamed. While his face melted. I won't tell anyone, I promise. No, please don't. If the hound so much as heard you mention it, I'm afraid all the knights in King's Landing would not be able to save you. <laughs> How'd you tell her that? Then. And forcing you to kill the beast was extreme. Though sometimes we go to extremes where our children are concerned. Don't come up and apologize. We've already killed the wolf. You're just a soldier, aren't you? You should go with her words, bruh. Your older brother was trained to lead and you were trained to follow. I was also trained to kill my enemies, your grace. As was I. Uh... I'm sorry, my lord. We'll fill up every room. Oh. Then you can sleep in the stable. As for myself, I don't require a large room. Lady Stark. What an unexpected <laughs> pleasure. <laughs> he recognized that right away. I'm sorry to miss you at Winterfell. Lady Stark. How fared your lord, sir? Lord Waldo is well, my lady. He has asked your father for the honor of his presence on his 90th name day. She got allies. So it seemed like. This man. And there conspired to murder my son, a boy of ten. In the name of King Robert and the good lords you serve, I call upon you to seize him. Mm. And return him to Winterfell to await the king's justice. Dang. That man was just trying to go find somewhere to sleep. just accidentally ran to the to the freaking queen but i don't blame her because she found out that the dagger belongs to him with that the uh, assassination dude had to kill her son so i don't blame her she don't know but he wasn't really there when all that stuff happened so it couldn't have been him but she went and called on the allies she's like you i know you i know your father this niche sees this man dang it was about to get crazy, I feel like. It was about to get crazy, but that was a pretty cool episode. Um, I'm about to get into the next one, though. Let's go. Oh, it's the hour. Jeez.